Oh my god, that's so bright. Oh. It's like 6.10 in the morning. All right, so here's the plan. Today, we're gonna go into town and I'm gonna take some pictures of myself for my Instagram. And then I might go shopping. And then I'm gonna just take a bunch of content today. So you'll get to watch a little bit of that. But that's what we're doing today. That's what we're vlogging today. Leave a thumbs up if you're excited. Okay, so now I'm gonna get this bag ready just with all the stuff that I need for this little photo shoot I'm doing. I also took my ADHD medicine this morning, so I'm gonna get a bottle of water because it always gives me really bad cotton mouth. All right, so I wanna be funnier with my YouTube channel, but I don't really know what to talk about. I feel like I'm funny, but like somebody else has to initiate the conversation in order for me to be funny. And I don't really mean to be funny, I just say stupid shit and other people think that it's funny. I think that I was trying to get monetized on YouTube, so I really wasn't like talking about the shit that y'all wanna know about. Because like it's just too raunchy. But at this point, I'm not sure that I really care. Cause I've been watching a bunch of like, you know, call her daddy and even like Tana Mojo and Harry Jowsey, like all those kinds of people. And none of them are monetized. All right, now I'm just putting on some finishing touches. And I always put my mascara on like when I get there, the bottom mascara, because I feel like it always runs. It doesn't look good, okay? Not always, but you know, like better safe than sorry. The good thing about taking pictures of yourself is I feel like it's easier to tell when there's something wrong with your makeup when you're like looking in the mirror rather than like looking in a picture. Plus you can always edit things out if you don't like them. But I actually wanna use this location for two of my outfits. Honestly, I might be able to get all three of them done right here. And that would be crazy, but also very convenient. Okay. How do I look? I'm gonna put on a bra too, so it looks like I have titties, right? Okay, I was gonna take pictures at this Macy's because it has this cute, like, I don't know. Um, but mall security came up and told me that I wasn't allowed to do that. So we're gonna go find someplace else to shoot. Okay, I'm at a different shopping center now. So hopefully I'm allowed to take pictures here. But I don't know. So I guess we'll just see. The problem I have with shooting content by myself is that I can't just like run up and take pictures and then leave. Like if somebody's taking a picture of me, we can just sneak up. But today, I have a bunch of shit to set up. I think I don't have the battery in this camera. Yep. The bimbo strikes again. Forgot to put the battery in the camera. Why is this impossible to do with fake nails on? There we go. Okay, so I was taking pictures, right? And this guy, Cat, called me. So I gave him the bird, right? Because, ew. Um, and he stopped and like backed up and started yelling at me. And now he's just like walking around. I don't fucking know what's going on. Like he parked his truck and he's like walking around. I don't know, does he work here? But he's still like yelling. It's kind of weird. It's kind of freaking me out to be honest. Okay, I'm about to change clothes and take more pictures in the same location because nobody's come up to me yet. And I feel like that's the hardest thing is trying to find places so you won't get yelled at. Okay, I just did a quick little outfit change, but I'm gonna go to a different location. One, cause there's not very much out here. And two, cause I'm sweating. Like I just wanna be in the car with my AC for a hot second. But here's the next fit. Let me know down below in the comments how you like it. <laughs> Oops, <laughs> it's a romper. Uh, I'm gonna be wearing the same shoes that I wore for that little blue number. And then I'm gonna go to PetSmart, pick up some dog food, and I'm gonna run to the mall and buy myself some new clothes. Cause I feel like, you know, I'm trying to build my brand and everything. Unfortunately, I don't have clothes that fit my brand. I just wear baggy t-shirts every day. So I'm gonna go shopping and you get to come with.
Okay, I just parked like a total fucking douchebag, but it was because there was a truck that was also parked like a fucking douchebag. Like, if I see a spot and I'm like, that's where I'm parking, like, that's where I'm parking, sorry. It doesn't matter how I have to park there, I will park there. Now we're gonna go shopping. I hope this doesn't mess up my makeup. I'm planning on shooting content later. Mission accomplished. I bought some new clothes to make content in and we're gonna head home now. Actually, we have to go get dog food first. Secured the bag. Why does everyone in Texas seem to have a chihuahua? I forgot to show this to y'all. Unless you follow me on Instagram, then you already saw it. But I made these little note sheets of like things I have to do every day. This is the first like draft, but I changed it and I'm planning on changing it again. I have some little updates that I need to make to it. You know, they have planners that you can like write everything that you need to do in, but I always forget things that I need to do. So these are just like all of the basic things that I need to do. And then I have some like blank spots that I can check off other random things that I need to write down. So let's see, what have we done today? We got dog food. Um, we took pictures for Instagram and we've been vlogging all day. It just helps me keep everything in order. I don't know, if you have ADHD like me, then you might like that idea. I am filling up on gas. So I thought that this would be the perfect time to have like a quick little chat. I feel like it's so hard to shop because I am like four different people in one body, right? Like I'm a Pisces. I'm living in a dream fantasy land. I have no idea what's going on in reality. So like every time I go shopping, I have a different like idea of who I want to be in my head. It's the weirdest thing. So like none of my clothes match. It's like every time I go on a little shopping spree is what I have. And like sometimes I can piece those together, but not always. And I feel like that's why it's been hard to like build a brand because I feel like I need to have a certain persona that is recognizable. And I just don't have that. That's so difficult for me because I want to be like 12 different people. Honestly, I've just been buying a bunch of pink and white clothes and hoping that it matches my aesthetic like as I go along. I just, every time I go shopping, I go straight for whatever is pink. Just because that's like my brand color. And I like pink. I think pink is like an empowering color. This might be a controversial opinion, but since it is typically associated with like women and more feminine people, no matter their gender identity, just like the feminine energy is always kind of associated with the color pink. And I think that that is really empowering. It's like taking back the color that it's so crazy in our society what different things can symbolize. But I love pink. I feel like it reminds me of all of the strengths that women have that a lot of men don't have or they suppress, you know? But I feel as if maybe like once a year I completely rebrand myself and then I have to like get rid of half of my clothes or I just don't wear them. Honestly, I don't really care what's in season or like what's in style. Like if something is cute to me, I'll still wear it. But I also feel like I don't pay attention to like social cues. Like I don't feel like I'm around people enough that I feel like I need to worry about that. Maybe I would be more anxious if I like hung out with more people, but the people that I hang out with, I just don't feel like that that's a problem. I'm not hanging out with any tight asses, that's for sure. If it's a little slutty, you can get away with anything. Oh. Okay, let's take a look at what I got. I got some underwear from Victoria's Secret. I got this matching set. It's like a sports bra and these biker shorts. I've been wanting biker shorts. I know that they've been like coming in style and I never got them, but I just got a pair and a matching bra. If you know anything about me, you know, I've been looking for a pink plaid skirt for like months. I got this shirt, this shirt, this shirt, and uh, this shirt. I'm gonna take 
these and put them in the washer so I can make content wearing them later. I know, I know, I'm putting my panties on my kitchen counter, but you know what? I'm about to put them in the washing machine, so it's fine. I should probably go grab some more laundry, shouldn't I? I think technically I'm not even supposed to be doing laundry right now since I live in Texas. So I'm trying on these shirts that I got and look at this. What is this? You can pinch it like a little side nipple. I can teach you how to flick a clit, just like that. What do you think? Do you think putting a bra on helped that at all or is it still like butterfly wings, kind of? I don't know. I shouldn't have pulled the tags off of this. Whoops, oh, whoops. Are you allowed to see that on YouTube? Now I'm going to take my phone and I'm gonna make some TikToks that like tell people to go follow me on Instagram. So I need to download all those pictures from my camera from earlier onto my phone. And then I'm probably gonna edit all of those too. And obviously since I don't have like a vlogging camera, I have to do that on my phone so I can't record all of it. Okay, so I just finished recording some OnlyFans content and I'm about to make those TikToks that I was talking about with the pictures that I'm gonna try and push people over to Instagram with. This top, I did not like the sides and I ended up tying it in the back. And then I also realized that they forgot the sunglasses that I bought. So I'm gonna have to get a hold of Forever 21 about that. But let me know if you prefer this vlog style or if I should keep doing videos with like searchable content. Which do you prefer? Let me know in the comments down below or by giving this video a thumbs up and subscribing to my channel. Hit the notification bell so that you're notified every time I upload a new video. And I'll see you in the next one.